Hi guys, it's Shelly Mars. Thanks for joining me. Today we'll be painting a 16 by 20 inch canvas and I'm excited about this. We're going to be doing something a little bit different. So hang on. Here we go. The painting is upside down right now and I'm adding color to the sky. I've cut out the basic shape of the left side of a horse's head on adhesive shelf liner, which is then affixed to the canvas. We'll use a straw to blow out some fluffy clouds. Use your finger to remove any unwanted color. The background is dry and is now covered with the opposing piece of shelf liner so we can work on the horse. We'll start with a base color of white. Now we get to add our colors. When you plan your piece, consider where you want your darks or shadows and put your darkest colors in those areas. Now we get to the fun part. A paper towel is cut up into smaller pieces. I will be wetting them as I go. A damp piece is dipped in activator and pulled slowly through the paint to create cells. We'll use a dark activator for the dark areas and a white activator for the light areas.
Shelf liner is removed while the paint is still wet. We need to clean up any paint that has leaked through. Now we can begin to rough in our details.
The horse has received another glaze in the shadow areas.
That could have been about done. <laughs> but why don't we paint a different background? So I covered the horse up again and did an earthy pour for the background. The sky gets a blowout of blue and white. The paint looks too thick along the edge of the shelf liner, so we'll blow it away a bit more. Now the shelf liner comes off, very carefully. <laughs> Again, we touch up the edges where the paint has leaked through. That could have been about done. But what if we did something different? Let's start with a very dark background. It has been dried. We'll need to deepen our shadows because of the high contrast.
It almost looks like he's out in the snow. Let's add some snow coming down. Use a mister to soften the edges.
His name is Snowflake. So what do you think? That was a lot of fun, wasn't it? Thanks for joining me. I hope to see you again soon. And until then, happy painting.